can you tell us maybe one thing you've learned in your career that you would like to pass down to the upcoming musicians today? This is a social business and um, it's a business of people. And so the more people you can network with and know, the better. Um, but just, you know, the other thing I was going to say as a songwriter and as a creator, um, I'm often asked, you know, what, how did you write this? How did you come up with this? Um, you know, where did this idea come from? And um, a lot of the time I just can't answer that because I think that writing in bulk is a better solution than sitting there and trying to come up with the greatest song I've ever written. When there's 12 songs that need to go on a record, there's around 30 that get written. Mm -hmm. And then what I do is I just get rid of the stuff that sucks. Right. You know, and how do you and, determine and, if something sucks? Is it literally, sometimes obviously it's blatant. Are there other times it just doesn't connect? Yeah. I think that that's, a, that's an intuitive thing. It's something that you know, as an artist have to sort of determine for yourself. What, you know, what about this sucks? Um, but don't be focusing on what's great about it when you're trying to get rid of stuff. You know, that's, that's the hardest thing to do. So what I'll do is I'll write a lot. I'll write without thinking. I'll just go, you know, write, blam, 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 blurt it out, you know, get it all out, get, you know, 25, 30 songs done. And then, um, and then it becomes a process of, of looking at the things that aren't good about, about the music. And then literally once you stop pulling stuff away, you're left with, what doesn't suck and what doesn't suck is is great and, and of course do you fine tune that yeah i mean it depends um sometimes uh so, you know sometimes what comes out first is what you do, you just leave it because absolutely it's great. sometimes that's the best because it yeah. just came from a place of yeah. pure creativity and that's expression. right i think there's a channeling of energy as an artist mm -hmm. you know and we've, we're pulling things constantly from the universe and pulling it out of the air and it's just sort of coming through us and and that i think is a um, something to be watched 